Thank you so much for being here this evening. We are the Yongsu To Conservatory of Music Trombone Quartet. On bass trombone, we have Shin Tanaka from Tokyo, Japan. <laughs> On tenor trombone, we have Hamidullah Bolibov from Tashkent, Uzbekistan. <laughs> and Alexei Uboshenko from Kiev, Ukraine. My name is Sam Armstrong, and I'm from Los Angeles. Um, and the piece you just heard is an excerpt from Joseph Haydn's oratorio, The Creation. And we'd like to play a transcription next of a string quartet by Franz Schubert. Uh, it's taken from his fourth quartet. And we do this a lot as trombone players. We steal repertoire from the string instruments. So, paise, sorry about that. Uh, and we change the key also. We always add a couple flats. So I hope you enjoy Franz Schubert, Quartet um, number four. Thank you. 
Next, we would like to take you even further back in time to the 17th century to visit a tune made famous by Simon and Garfunkel called Scarborough Fair. This is a Scottish ballad uh, from the mid 1600s. And uh, it's interesting to hear a reharmonization and a modern rendition of this very old um, text and, and modal tune that would have been around the time of Shakespeare's life. And followed by that, we're going to play a madrigal by Thomas Morley entitled My Bonnie Lass. So please enjoy uh, these two madrigals. Thank you very much. So one thing we like to think about when we play such ancient music, it's kind of like a living museum when we visit these madrigals. They're virtually unchanged, just note for note. This is the way they would have heard it and sang together um, by voice, no instruments. So the next composition is an original for trombone quartet. It's called In Memoriam by Raymond Primru. It uses a lot of non-traditional harmonies, dissonances, fourths and fifths, and unresolving tones for you music theory geeks out there. But um, it's a little hard to grab onto a specific subject matter or theme in this, other than it's written in memory of someone. So um, we hope you enjoy In Memoriam by Raymond Primrow.
Thank you very much. So uh, as you might tell, the trombone quartet is a very versatile, dynamic group. We can play transcriptions, originals, ancient music, Baroque, classical, and now jazz. We're going to play a tune called St. Louis Blues, made famous by Louis Armstrong. Um, and it's quite an old standard. Louis Armstrong was a forefather of jazz music, and um, it's, it's pretty neat to hear his old recordings where now so many people have taken after him and emulated his vocal style of playing, which really is what it's all about, singing through your instrument. This is only a microphone, not this, but this also. So I hope you enjoy St. Louis Blues.
Thank you. So that was a, a nice little feature for our bass trombonist, Shin Tanaka, who Shin and Hamadullah are both freshmen this year in the Yangtze To Conservatory. Uh, we're very proud of them. I think, what, are you 18 and 19? About, yeah, no older than 19. So really doing uh, amazing things. So yeah, give him a hand. It's just so neat how we come together from so far around the world, Los Angeles, Kiev, Tashkent, Tokyo, and here we are in Singapore, finally making music again together for a live audience. And I would just like to extend a heartfelt thank you to the Esplanade for making this possible and inviting us for this Cool Classics series. So thank you, Esplanade, for this wonderful invitation. So next, we'll move to Broadway. We'll do a selection from Leonard Bernstein's West Side Story entitled One Hand, One Heart. For our last number, it wouldn't be band week without a march. And we would like to play an arrangement of a Henry Fillmore march entitled Teddy Trombone. And you can probably guess what this is going to feature. A lot of glissandi, what we do best. And it also features our freshman trombonist, Hamidullah. So please enjoy Teddy Trombone. Thank you so much for being here. We hope to see you sooner than later. <laughs> 